Hi everyone, just come to show you the winnings I got from Tara's challenge. Um, Tara set a challenge in my craft club just before Christmas and the challenge was to either make three small handmade items like three tags, three cards, three of anything like that, bottle cap, charms, what have you, or to alter one thing and... Um, Alter, alter something that was destined for the trash and make it into something useful so if you look back in my videos you'll see i altered um a camembert balsa cheese box into like an earring um an earring box for a nightstand and these are the winnings that i won from that um i got a 2013 diary so you can refer back to date and I got a 2014 diary. I got um, a to-do list and I go through tons of to-do lists. So that's um, brilliant. I've got a name, address and numbers book. Also a telephone numbers. And then I got some notebooks. So I've got the fashion coloured ruled notepaper, the lavender ruled notepaper and the yellow ruled notepaper. So that's eight little booklets there and they're all the proper Filofax brand so I just need to nip out now and get myself um, a tiny Filofax. <laughs> so thanks Tara for those. Um, I was also chatting with Tara on Facebook as we do all the time and we were discussing um, these washer bags and she sent me two and I've used one and it was brilliant and she also sent me um that's my american friend sending her english friends some english tea bags so they're big low and i'm looking forward to trying those because i've never even heard of them so it'll be interesting to try them thanks very much for those tara and this was a small swap tara and i are doing and i'm sending her and her husband some hot chocolate sachets um some coffee sachets some uh stick pins that i'd recently brought with diamante tops tara like them so i'm gonna put a few of them in and a few other goodies for this little swap we're doing so that was that and the rest of the things i'm going to show you now these are christmas presents off tara um i i sent her her christmas presents and she stuck photographs of what i sent up on the craft page and i'm now going to show what she bought me which is the, they're all beautiful so first of all there's this stampin up tag kit and if you go onto youtube and um let me see the name of it it's called stamp a tag kit by stampin up so if you put that in the search you'll get a few videos on this and there's one of the tags i've already made let me show you it's a lovely little tag set you get a stack of tags you get two stamps two twines and two inks in cherry cobbler and old olive and even when you finish that the the box is a lovely little box that you could alter which i will be doing so i got that off tara and i also got this now this is um a close to my heart memory box and what it is is a lovely box with a magnetic closure which you can decorate and then you get an absolute whoops you get an absolute stack of these and i would say these are about three by three and the chipboard and i did go on youtube to see what type of thing ladies were well and ladies or men whatever what crafters were doing with these and most people were using them like a memory box and decorating it with paper and putting photographs on both sides and um, one lady done her baby from from um, birth to 12 months she done stacks of baby photographs watching the baby grow which i thought was a nice idea um another lady um painted them all and then she'd stick two images 
on the same image on two of the tiles and she made a game of pairs with it and you can all also play snap as well with that idea so i think i'll probably put uh photographs of my kids growing up and uh, myself and have it as a tiny photographic memory box and i will also decorate the box as well so thanks for that tara here's some more crafty goodness here's uh, a cane company chip box and there's seven shaped pieces in there and i'll just show you the back there's the fonts that you get and i'll try and open it because do you know the circles you get on the paper pads it had four great big circles and it was terrible to try and open so let me see if i can open it now i'm actually trying to open this box now with a screwdriver believe it or not <laughs> try not to damage the box right here we go i'll not get them all out but these are basically the little chipboards and you get letters on and they've decorated the tiles with flowers and uh, I think they're all the, more or less the same colours blue, reds, pinks but the a lot of the there's one destined for Tara a lot of them are foiled can you see that? and the flowers are glossy and that's the thickness of them so lovely little set of um letters and you get three complete the other way you get three complete alphabets so that's them i also got this this is another close to my heart it's um a banner kit you can either make a banner an actual banner with it or a banner shaped album because you get all these ring binders as well but i'll actually be making a banner and there's just enough to spell out sue kitten and i'll be threading it with ribbon and putting that on my stall when i do some craft fairs so thanks tara i got this as well i'll try and open it away from the camera so you don't hear all the rattling I absolutely love this. It's a Bow Bunny album and you get the page, the chipboard pages which are covered in the paper and the two rings, ring binders to bind it together and it's called uh, Bow Bunny Rejoice mini album and that paper is the Christmas Rejoice paper and I'll just shine some light so you can see the beauty of it right that's the first page gorgeous paper and very very thick chipboard so that's the first page try to get it all in frame right that's the first page and then the back of that is that make a gorgeous Christmas album once you'd put the um, the rings in you'd be complete because you would you wouldn't need any other embellishments it's so lovely the paper and it's nice and thick and sturdy and it'd be a shame to cover any of the designs up with pockets I, I would with the on that side you could stick a belly band and stick tags in or a pocket here's the next one gorgeous colors and I love the shapes all the shapes of the pages are different so you could put a pocket on there and stick stuff in or just a large photograph, a large family photograph. Right, 
I like that page. As you can see, all the pages are different shaped. That's nice. And this is the last one. Gorgeous, I love that. Oh, and that. I love that as well, yeah. Try not to go too fast, don't want to make you dizzy. And that's what it looks like when you've pieced it all together. It's really thick and sturdy. I love that. So thanks, Tara, for that. Now, Tara also sent me um, a dressing table set and my mum used to have one of these on a dressing table and so did my grandma you get the mirror the brush and the comb and the brush is nice and soft and you get this gorgeous design on them all it's like a pink rose with green leaves on top of the, the they're all trimmed with silver all of them and on top of the silver is this pink rose design and the green leaves absolutely gorgeous beautiful look how sparkling it is gorgeous i absolutely love that thanks tara Oh, it's quite heavy as well. 